I thought I'd narrow down my party. So I got rid of the Swadian Knights and the Rodok Sergeants. So I'm down to the Companions, Vagers, and one Chief. I kept the Chief. That's about it. I do have 15 Knights, Vager Knights, 19 Vager Marksmen, one Vager Archer, one Vager Infantry, and six Vager Guards. So, instead of being over 2,000, it's a little over 1,000 a week. So, I'm chasing 40 bandits with this group. And I thought I'd do a video showing um, how well I can, uh, we can do with just the Vagers against these bandits who themselves use bows. So let's chase them and uh, surrender. He tells me to prepare to die. And let's do this uh, fight. F1, F1, then one, F2, F1, F2, F1. Five is the archers in mine, F2, F1, to get them all lined up. Then three, no, two F1 to move my companions. Three F1 to put my Vager Knights over on the other side. Notice Tega Bandits are already getting killed by my Marksmen. Just look at how many the marksmen have taken out. And now have everybody charge. There's hardly any left. Now, uh, F1, F1, hold this position. And then 1, F2, F1, F2, F1. Then 5, F2, F1. And that's it. Now look at the results. Tab. I had two soldiers wounded. They had 40 killed. Two renown, nine morale. If I had my larger group, I wouldn't have gotten any renown out of this. And they still do, they still do very well without the Swadian Knights or the, um, or the Rodok Sergeants. And uh, that's all I wanted to um, show you, mostly vagars.